Hello everyone, in today's video I will be showing you how you can change your prompt in the terminal on a Mac. So we're going to dive right in. So what we'll be doing is you can see in our terminal we have this text that says change this and that's the text we're going to be changing. So the first thing we'll do is just type clear and hit enter just so you can see and have a more clear picture of what we're going to be doing in this video. So this change this, we are going to change this to the name of this channel. So to begin, the first thing we'll do is navigate to our home directory, and we'll do that by using the change directory or cd command. So we'll type cd space and then tilde. The tilde is the squiggly line. Then you'll hit enter, and now we're in our home directory. And now we have to create a file called dot bash underscore profile. Now you may already have this file, and if you do, then I'll show you what you can do, because I already have this file created on my device. So my, my process may be a little different if you're creating this file for the first time. But either way, the most important things we have to do will say the same. So we'll type vi, and then the name of our file, which is .bash underscore profile, and hit enter. Yeah, so you'll see I get this text, and I have to say that I want to edit the file. So I'll hit shift and e, or just a capital E. And then I'll be able to actually see the file, and we're going to edit it. So in order to edit this file, we have to go inside of insert mode, and you'll just hit the I key to do that. And now we're in insert or edit mode. If this is your first time creating this file, you might not have all of this stuff, and then you'll just do this next command. So we'll go down to import path, to sorry, export PS1 equals, and then in quotes, you'll see the actual prompt. So we'll navigate over to that dollar sign and keep hitting the backspace. And then we'll change that to whatever we want to appear. You could also just leave it with the dollar sign and then you'll just have a blank prompt. But we'll change it to the name of this channel, which is Revernals. You should also like, comment, and subscribe on this video so we know to keep bringing you good videos. And that's pretty much all we have to do to change our prompt. So we need to exit this mode. So we'll do that by hitting the escape key. And you can see we're no longer in insert mode. And once we're out of exit mode, we can hit the colon. And then we'll type WQ and hit enter. Now all we have to do is exit out of terminal and open it back up and we'll see that our prompt has changed. So let's do that now and I'll check back with you in a couple of seconds. Now that we're back in terminal, you can see that our prompt has changed to Revernos, which is the name of the channel you should like, comment, and subscribe to and click the notification bell so you don't miss an upload. We just recently rebranded and we have a lot of great content coming in the future. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss a single upload. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.